Welcome to another tutorial for ADS Editing and News. Thought we'd have a quick look at how to get all of these audio files to be the same value or the same audio level, or at least something that's more sensible than 0 dB. So if I take a production music clip and stick it down on a stereo track, we can see that peak volume is very loud and peaking up at zero because it's a normalized track to all peaks to zero dB. If I want to change all of the levels, I could simply right click and go to properties and change the gain in here to be like minus 12 dB. And then I would have that set to minus 12 dB. And when I played it back on the timeline, it's much lower which is what I want for all of my clips, but I can't do them all at the same time like this. I don't have a little checkbox that, like I do with the color. If I change all the color, I can change those all as a group, but I can't do the same with the audio. So how do I fix this? Well, let's range select all of these clips down to the bottom here and drag them all onto our stereo track. And now I have a button mapped over here for normalize selected tracks. You can find this button in the settings. If we go to user settings and user interface and buttons and on the timeline category of buttons, I have mapped, you'll see down the bottom here, normalize selected tracks. And you can do one for selected clips that you choose on the timeline as well. So I've placed that over here. Now I have the track selected. I don't need all of these selected. I just simply press this button and it gives me an option. Let's normalize to a different audio level. So let's try minus 25 dB. It goes through and changes all of their relative values. Now if we play through that peak for this track, now I'm not getting a peak very high at all. So if I take all of these clips, shift click range, drop them onto my stereo track, they're too high, make sure my track is selected over here, and I press the normalize track button. Make it minus 20 dB or perhaps minus 18 dB so you can get a low average for your music. It will go through and re-render all the waveforms and set them all at a lower average. Now I can simply go back up here to my bin, delete the originals that are at 0 dB and then drag them back into the bin. And you'll notice that they've all got new average weighted audio levels or gain levels. So every time you want to use it, it'll already have its low value set.